discipline, and this is something we need. We've realised that these guys are human beings after all. So, South Africa's third corner, Kumalo to take it. Kadebe, the keeper came, and Masinga has scored! For Masinga's goal, the goalkeeper came, completely missed it, and I think for Masinga just stuck his head in there, and he is now got goal number eight for South Africa, and that's coming exactly 20 minutes into the match. As you say, Mark, with a tip from Dr. Kamalo, Philemon got his head to it, and the ball just lofted over the top, the keeper came, he was miles away, he just off his head, beats the fullback on the lines in mid here. South Africa 1, Brazil 0. They get uh, 25 minutes for the goal, the 25th minute, former singers, 8th for South Africa, he's now back on top as the country's leading goal scorer, but uh, the singer... That's a good turn from Helmut and Kalele. Throwing it in the middle, the singer, Kamala shot, oh, South Africa are leading 2-0. Helmut Mekulele goes down the right wing, he crosses the ball, he's headed out, and Dr. Kamal hits it on the volley in the corner. I watched the Brazilians when they actually stood off Dr. Kamalo and allowed him to shoot. But again, who cares? South Africa team Brazil nil. Or Kamalo. What's the replay, Mark? Actually turned the back on him. Quite incredible. Straight through the legs, two of the experienced uh, captain Aldair. Look at the shot. And the number three turns the back on the ball. Aldair, as you say. Dr. Kamala just clipping him on the ankles there. Zé Maria now. He has been one Brazilian with uh, a little bit of intent. Savio. Can he get past Tinkler and Toby? Flavio shots. It's in the back of the net. Flavio has scored for Brazil. Set up by Savio. And now possibly we've got a match on our hands. Mark, that's the first time the Brazilians have really gone wide. When the ball came out, it was played wide to Savio. He cut inside his left foot played the ball and they scored making it 2-1 as you say Mark there it is he cuts inside left foot Aras answer unsighted by a Brazilian player on uh, Bebeto it looked like 2-1 and I think that's exactly what the game needed but I've sooner seen the third goal for South Africa rather than the first one for Brazil Aronson did get a touch to yeah, that's a good long early ball out Bebeto has possession for Brazil he's the danger man this is a great pass and a chance here for Rivaldo. Shot, yes! So I, easy. I was just going to say to you, Mark, he's lost his chance. He's got no right foot. He had to pull it back on his left foot, but he bent it round um, Adams. Uh, a superb goal. A few more smiles down the bench from, uh, from the Brazilians. Well, South Africa's defence has gone to pot in this uh, second half as the Brazilians were in the first half. They picked up a gear, and it was ever so easy for uh, Rivaldo. Is it right, Mark, that John Moretti must be the last man there? I mean, he's the one that went to Rivaldo Riva there, and he bent it down there. It makes you wonder where... attacking down the right-hand side, which he wasn't doing in the first half. Great cross, bent. Oh, oh excellent it. goal from Bebeto! Do you know, so it did. It seems like the easier thing was to head it. He laid back and volleyed it. Oh, look at Zagalo. Isn't he enjoying this? Well, he's done nothing all day. Well, it came from Ziamiri. He went down the line. He pulled the ball across, he laid back Bebeto. Surely, Mark, that was the hardest thing to do. The easy thing might have been headed in, but that's the Brazilians. We've criticised Bebeto, me in particular. But he put his money where his mouth was there. A great volley, Anderson, no chance.